Still at noon, a new nonprofit hopes to enrich kids' lives with the game of soccer. CBS 13's Camby Brown has more on how a trip overseas inspired the founders. This all started with an international trip, getting to see kids with the love of soccer. Christian, you were on this trip. You guys were in Bethlehem. What was this like to see kids so excited about getting to play soccer? It was incredible. It was an incredible experience to be able to deliver soccer balls to kids in need. Uh, coming from an ultimate high of seeing the birthplace of Jesus Christ to going to a war-torn little village, seeing the little kids just playing in rubbish and then passing out soccer balls to them was a big aha moment we had to create this. Yeah. Um, yeah, children chanting football, 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 and feeling the vibration of the little feet going around, you know, the building where we were having a seminar. It was, uh, it was impactful. Yeah, so that's where it started. And so they just had a shipment of soccer balls go to Panama. And they want to be able to do that here locally, too. And so they have a big foot golf tournament that is happening this Saturday. You still have time to register if you're interested. Now, we're talking about soccer. So why foot golf for this uh, tournament? Totally. Foot golf is just soccer and golf combined. It's really for all ages. Um, we want parents. We want kids. We want anybody of any ability to be out be out here being active and that was really our goal um, to raise awareness about our foundation and let people have a good time. And what is the foundation called so people can get online and uh, and and register? Puente Football Foundation and we're at puentefootball.com. Okay, and that's football F U T B O L. Perfect, Canvi. Thank you. Football, yes, of course. The soccer balls from the event will be donated to our local chapter of Big Brothers Big Sisters.